Hi there, this is David, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Heroes Song of the Ocean. Since last time, I spent quite a bit of time doing the Capital Road monster, and uh, I also went and I stole a lot of these books that deal uh, different deadly attacks from the regular enemies in there, and I stole a bunch of the various charms from the boss in there. You really want to try to get the fire charms, but it's random, whatever you can steal from the guy. And every single time that you fight that monster um, and beat him with uh, somebody from the Vermilion or somebody from the Moonlight Witch uh, games in your party, you then get a Moonlight Orb or a um, Vermilion Orb. So I got a bunch of Moonlight Orbs. Let's say that you have Yurio and Chris in your party, you'll get two Moonlight Orbs. If you like just have Chris in your party, you'll get one Moonlight Orb. And then I stuck Marty in my party as well, and I got a bunch of Vermilion Orbs as well. So, yeah, if you really care about them, you can look in the album here and, you know, see what it is. It's just portraits and stuff. It's nothing too great, but it's here. Yeah, so anyway, in so doing that, it's actually a really good place to level up. So I got everybody up to level 4. McBain made his way up into level 5. And uh, doing so, he got a new skill, Harden, which raises his defense and power, if you really care about that. And uh, let's see, Jan got a new special spell as well, the Pero Pero Cure, which is a, like, a medium HP heal. So yeah, I highly recommend doing that, you know, just because it's a good place to grind, there's tons of good stuff to steal there, and you might as well get some, you know, orbs and stuff, what, whenever you're grinding, rather than grinding out here and not really getting anything. I guess I just feel like, you know, if you're gonna spend time grinding, you get a lot more bang for your buck whenever you grind over there than, um, than, you know, grinding out here. Urgh, get away from me! I really honestly feel like the game was more zoomed out in the Windows version than it is here, because otherwise it's very hard to see everything. I wish that there was a mini-map. That's what, really my one complaint about these games, is that it feels too zoomed in, and there's no mini-map. It really just drives me crazy. You can't even, like, hit the start button or anything to, uh, see a map of the area. Oh, really? I have a fan club? Oh, wow, I really do have a fan club, don't I? Whoa! I gotta beat him off with a stick here! Oh, Forte is kind of cute. He's not the cutest, but he's kind of cute. Oh, yeah. Altos? Yeah. <laughs> what can I say? Whoa, they're like dragging him along. I'm really kind of surprised that Jan's going along with them. I would figure that Jan would be like, screw this and walk away like he normally does. But, you know, he's a, he's a trusty, faithful dog. Well... Yeah, they're main party members. Oh, I guess so. But Una, not my girlfriend! He is kind of smoldery. Yeah. Go, McBain. <laughs> um, yeah, to get away from you guys. Oh. This is different, though. This is like the first time that a guy has actually had, you know fan girls normally from what i've seen you have somebody like laura who's a girl who also has fan girls yeah <laughs> don't be a dirty old man mcbain but then again i mean if they're giving out those kisses for free might as well take some oh the boom what boom what idea oh yikes I don't want to be your prey. Oh, man. That guy is not giving me some good vibes. Oh, yeah, we are kind of busy here. We've got to go. Okay. Yeah, later. See ya. Then they scatter to the winds. Thank you. Okay, yeah, we do need to get that passport issued. Well, perfect. Hey there. We have to hold a meeting with the fans? Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, they want to hear me perform. I guess I can make a performance. Whoa. 
What's going on here? Kids acting wild and crazy. I wish that we could run that fast. But unfortunately, we have to go at a snail's pace. Lucky us. Yeah, no kidding. Eh, that'll just teach them. Yeah, seriously. If they trip and fall, they won't do it again. It's Darwinism in action. Eh, whatever. I really don't care about that old man. Screw him. Wait, is this guy like... He like totally pushed me out of the way. What the hell? <laughs> Uh, yelling at them isn't working. Maybe you should try something else. Trip a bitch? I don't know. Yeah, you already yelled and it didn't work. Sorry about it. Oh, okay. Yeah, well that was his hometown. So he didn't really retreat, he just went back home. Yeah, sure. Trip of a lifetime! Literally and figuratively. Oh, okay. Yeah, we didn't win. We just got second prize. You know what Abby Lee Miller says? Second prize is the first loser. Oh, but this guy graded me a first prize. Hey, hey, thanks. Oh, um, sure, I guess. Oh, you'll sing an opera in return. Eh, might as well. Okay. Um, let's try, let's see, what was the, uh, the one that we got that I haven't really heard? I think it was Happy Traveler, which is what we got from the Leon's book. Yeah, that's a new one. We haven't heard that one, so I left it in there. And it wasn't 30 seconds long. It was much shorter. Thank you. Oh, I guess he's performing his opera right now. Um, okay. Oh. Okay. Huh. Man, this Leon guy really gets around, doesn't he? Yeah, we kind of just played you one of his songs, actually. Oh, okay. Really? Huh. We have all eight volumes of the opera. The first and the last. That means it's the only one done by him. We will get a chance to look at the opera, but it's rather long, so I'm just going to stick it in today's end slate. I'll show you where it is, though. Oh, well, thanks. And then if you go over here, we get a hidden treasure. Uh, yeah. Come on, Forte. You can do it. There we go. Woohoo! Get over the ocean number two. Nice. And, uh, let's see. Let's just go around and explore this town, see what there is to see. I've already talked to you. I'm done with you. Uh, hey there, girl. What's going on? Oh. Oh, bad people. Oh, no. Can't have bad people. Um, I just performed. You weren't listening. Oh. Oh. I hope not. I don't want kids to get lost. Right here is that opera that he was talking about. And again, that will be in today's end slate. Uh, yeah. I'm sure your father told you that. Oh, well, we're headed over there. Gotta get there. Oh, well, thanks. You know, I try. I moisturize every night. That's the key to being cute. That and diet and exercise and all that kind of good stuff. Anyway, moving right along. Hey there. Oh. <laughs> I guess that would get a uh, red-blooded male excited for the... Uh, for the uh, performance and everything. Oh, 
Really? Don't you mean, uh, McBain? Yeah, it is me. Oh. Well, wouldn't it make sense for him to receive first prize if he was McBain's disciple, as you put it? I don't know, I would say he was his apprentice or trainee or student. I wouldn't really use disciple as the word, but sure, whatever. Anyway, next place that we need to go to is right in here. Oh, okay, this is a great rung who's going to issue us uh, the uh, passports. Yeah, McBain really does get around. Oh, well, thanks. Hey there. Okay. Well, this will be really easy. I can't wait. Hopefully we don't have to go around to like 20 different people to get a passport. No, actually they do make it rather easy for you this time. Oh, well he is 14. He's practically a grown adult by JRPG terms. Um, it's the same attire that he's been wearing all game long. Oh, really? Best friend since childhood? Huh. Oh, well, he didn't really retreat. He just went back to his home. Oh, really? He has heroic epics? Who knew? Um, yeah, that's what it means to go around the known world. I try. Oh, well, it's only been ten years. How much could the world really have changed? Oh, the numerous empires and militaristic state? Huh. Might have to be something from Lufia, too. Oh, well, yeah. You know, he knows what he's doing and all that. Oh, just coincidentally, it's free today. We don't just get, like, you know, an old-time friend discount or anything? Okay, so we have two emissaries in this town, Graysoul and Buridane. And we might as well go ahead and get entry permission from Graysoul and Buridane while we're here. Oh. Yeah, so, okay, I think that's everything that we can do in here. Oh. Yeah, that's what the guy just said. Okay. Yeah, I hope so too. These fans are really obnoxious. This actually reminds me a lot of Prophecy of the Moonlight Witch, having to go and get passports and then having to get them stamped and all that kind of stuff. So anyway, go over here, and this is the, uh, which, which embassy? Oh, this is the Borodane embassy. Yeah, there's some really good maps on game FAQs that you really should use uh, to make your way around here. It just makes it more efficient. Yeah, there's really no purpose. We just want to look around, go on a tour. We could be international spies for all you know. Yeah, what was Jan just doing? Jan's like, I don't want to walk all this way. Screw this. I love Jan. <laughs> my favorite. Oh, oh, what's going on? Oh, um, a troubadour plays music and artist creates art. He paints and stuff, I guess? I don't know. Oh, or you could be an acrobat and be an artist. I would imagine, well, I get like a performing artist, I guess. I don't know. This, this translation is so wonky. We already got a passport! We just got it stamped there. Or are we getting multiple passports? We have to get a passport for each and every country, maybe? I don't know. Hey there. Rish Campbell. Oh, he's buying islands? Oh. Huh. So he's a known bad guy, yet he has all this influence... Eh, actually, it reminds me a lot of the real world. We have a lot of known bad guys who have a lot of influence and a lot of money. It's a pretty crappy world that we live in, but it is what it is. 
So now that we've gotten our passport stamped by Borodane or and or gotten a new passport, I'm not really sure what we did. Have I talked to you before? Hey there. Oh, I don't care what your name is. No stranger than any other names that I've seen here. His voice is his finishing move. Shut up. <laughs> What? 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 What does that have to do with money? That has nothing to do with money. I don't get it. Wouldn't you name, like, your kid Rich if you didn't want him to worry about money? Or, I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. What is she talking about? Ugh. Whatever. Get over here. Urgh. I'll try. I'll do my best. I'll think about it. Oh, well, thanks. I don't know, just some random NPC that I'll never talk to again. It's exactly who she is. So, yeah, we've gotten the Borrow Dane stamp. Now we need to go in here and get the Grey Soul stamp. Oh, okay. So there's another country, Pensola, but we have to enter there through Grey Soul. Huh. Well, thanks for the information. I'll have to keep that in mind for later. Oh, that was enormously easy. Let Tora Tudo? I, I think that that's where we're at right now. I'm pretty sure. I could check the map and double check. Oh, I might as well. Get away from me, pet. Uh, let's see. Yeah, okay, so that is where we are right now. Okay, so continuing right along. I should probably praise the pet, actually. He's not really getting me many items. I'll praise the pet off screen. Whatever. Get over here. Oh. Well, that's not helping, because there's some criminal who said that I'm his prey. Uh. Wow, everybody voted for me to be first place, yet I still got second place. Oh, well, thanks. Huh. Everybody has nothing but nice things to say to me. I thought that there was only three judges at that recital, and two of them voted me first place, yet I only got second place? I don't know. Maybe I'm mistaken. Who knows? Wow, this is like a really big inn. Man. Get over here, you annoying girl. I haven't seen your sister anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> you should really get that lisp fixed. Go to a speech therapist or something. Oh, poor girl. Maybe she's just upset. Oh, no, I'm good. A nice thing about going to those tuning forks is after you defeat, like, the boss monster of those, um, you know, the little instances that you can do, you get fully healed. So that's very, very nice. Your name is Soup? Your name is Soup. I don't know which is worse, Soup or Egg. Which one was it that I was playing where the, where the guy's name was Egg? I thought that was ridiculous. <laughs> Oh. I don't think that you'd be able to stay very long without getting caught if you're not going to pay your bill. Oh, yeah, this guy's already on to you. Something tells me he's going to kick yo bitch ass out very soon. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. Well, is this the tavern? I guess it could be, like, it could double as a tavern. I don't know, an inn and a tavern? Who knows? Here's a weapon shop that sells the exact same weapons as the woman who sold us, um, that junk out on the highway, so there's no need to go in there. Is there anything here? No, there's nothing. We can buy resurrect patterns and stuff like that if you really want to, but I don't. Let's get out of here. My fan? I have multiple fans! Come on now. Don't undercut me like that. Uh, we were trying to sneak out. Oh, well, yeah. Even though we already performed. Why do we should perform for you guys again? Ugh. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll play for you. It's fine. Why not? Oh, really? Yuri and his clones. 
Couldn't they at least give them, like, separate sprites or something? I don't know. That one guy's bandana looks like it's a little bit of a different color. Really? I'm fine again? They always play this stupid song, and I can't really skip it either. Like, I hate this song. It's so boring and derivative. I like the other one better that I played earlier. BAM! <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow, these guys aren't, uh... The smartest, are they? Man, they're getting their ass beat. These criminals suck. Kind of remind me of the crappy criminals from uh, Moonlight Witch. <laughs> oh, he's coming back for more, are ya? Well, they're super fans. Yeah, this is the best part. Bam! Knock a bitch out. Love it. So if they got beat up by little 10-year-old Bieber fans, then why do you think that they would be, you know, good criminals and could, I don't know, steal from us? Screw you guys. Oh, okay, we have to go to the pier in Fargo to go on a world tour. Oh, they're going to give us a send-off. Oh. Okay. Yeah, besides, then we'd have to, like, protect you guys all the way to Fargo. Oh, well, thanks. Okay. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, you know, we can't get by on a cute face. Beauty fades. Oh, well, if you say so. Okay. We're gonna head off to Fargo next time. I'll let's play the Legend of Heroes Song of the Ocean. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe, and stick around for the end slate. Have a good day.